Well, guys, police described the suspect as a white transient man with a scruffy beard, and he was wearing a green altercation happened right here at Sweetwater Elementary before any kids arrived at school. No parent ever wants to see police officers at their child's school. It's, it's very scary. I mean, you'd think Port Orange, you know, is safe and um, I don't know. Yeah, it's just crazy. Sarah Long found out her son's school was on lockdown through Facebook. Panic, you know, I freaked out. Who can blame her? Police say a man attacked assistant principal Adrian Bronson just past six this morning. He was doing his normal security sweeps through the school before the kids arrived, and an individual was on campus and obviously surprised him and uh, punched him. This person also had a box cutter. His shirt was sliced. His skin was not. Bronson escaped and ran to the school to call police. The suspect ran the opposite direction and disappeared into the woods. When cops arrived, they started the manhunt, but no luck. That's when school officials decided to cancel classes for the day. Sweetwater Elementary School buses were rerouted to Horizon Elementary. Parents came here to pick up their children. Came here right away and um, they told me where to go pick them up. So it's just very scary. I drove like 70 miles here. He's probably confused, scared. So I'm going to go get him and bring him home. <laughs> We're told the assistant principal is doing fine tonight, but he declined any media interviews. Now, remember, police are still looking for that suspect, so if you know, have any information about his whereabouts, you're asked to call investigators. Reporting live in Port Orange, Jackie Orozco, Fox 35 News.